cultivate a forgiving spirit reading from scripture Ephesians chapter 4 verses 31 and 32 get rid of all bitterness rage and anger brawling and slander along with every form of malice be kind and compassionate to one another forgiving each other just as in Christ God forgave you the most important characteristic of a human heart is to possess a forgiving spirit becoming bitter and resentful when we are hurt keeps us in bondage and keeps us away from the blessing and the power that the forgiveness of god brings yet god makes it possible through his gift of grace to help us respond with a forgiving heart and a forgiving spirit as a child of god a forgiving spirit is an essential attitude that we need to possess let us look at some truths that will help us develop a forgiving spirit first of all jesus is our example to follow and he would not require of us something which he himself wouldn't do jesus while he walked on this earth operated with a forgiving spirit every time even while he was hanging on the cross being mocked his first response was father forgive them for they know not what they do this came out of his love and compassion for his enemies for us to have a forgiving spirit we look to christ we look to jesus and follow that example we also remind ourselves as to how much god gave up to forgive us having received god's mercy for our very many sins should really motivate us to extend this forgiveness to others we also remind ourselves that any wrong done to us falls far short from the punishment we actually de- deserve because of how deeply our sins have hurt and offended god the father we need to remember that our forgiveness extends to others the same mercy shown to us when he forgave the debt of sin we could not pay we recognize that having a forgiving spirit opens the door to fellowship with god and in contrast having unforgiveness opens the door to satan an unforgiving spirit has bitterness and hatred and this is the place where the devil thrives in it is a place where the devil gets a very strong foothold that's why paul urges us in ephesians chapter 4 verses 26 and 27 in your anger do not sin and do not let the sun go down in when you are angry lest you give the devil a foothold by forgiving others we embrace the fellowship and communion we have with god because god works on the principle of a forgiving spirit where he forgives us which leads us to a greater fellowship and communion with him lastly as it says in our scripture verse a forgiving attitude is one that highlights a kind of attitude that abandons every animosity and every strife where we make an intentional attempt to put away to get rid of all malice all strife all spitefulness and put on the very nature of Jesus which is to be kind to be compassionate to be readily and to be freely willing to forgive as Jesus did so let's make this our daily prayer that god changes our heart to embrace a spirit of forgiveness at all times let's pray father god we thank you for teaching us today that you care and you love when we have a forgiving spirit teach us to look to you as our example to forgive the way that you forgave to extend mercy as you did teach us to get rid of all bitterness and strife and malice 
and put on your nature which is to be kind and compassionate and readily forgiving one another we pray that by your spirit you will change our heart of stone and give us a forgiving spirit even as we deal with our brothers around thank you for hearing our prayer in jesus precious name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org